Dozens of parents are pulling their kids out of a Commerce City school, worried the school has a bed bug problem like this. Now, school officials say there's no infestation. Denver 7's Mark Boyles live at Adams City High School where students insist, yes, the building is infested. And that's why parents were lined up around the building today to pull their students out. The big question now, is there a big bed bug problem or just is this all big buzz? It's one of the pictures that has everyone talking at Adams City High School. They've been just going around like the whole school. Everybody's been saying, watch out for the bed bugs, watch out for the bed bugs. And in this video given to us by a student, you can see the whole front office filled with students being signed out of school. She grabs the phone and she goes, um, can your kid leave? And she, the, like the parents will say yes and she'll sign the paper and then like on to the next. This is what students say is a bed bug in a school classroom and the idea of an infestation is taking off on social media and throughout the hallways. It's like an epidemic's going on. It's everybody's going crazy. They're all trying to get out of the school. Teachers aren't even letting them really get out of class to even know anything about this. The district tells us they first learned someone reported seeing a bed bug in a classroom late yesterday. They say maintenance crews fumigated for them overnight and still found no evidence of dead bugs of any kind. The district says students talk, and this is just a big rumor, but some parents are not taking this lightly. They climb in your shoes, your clothes, your backpacks. I mean, everything. It's disgusting. He'll probably be out of school for over a week. We asked a local pest control specialist to tell us what this bug is. They said bed bugs have to be identified under a microscope because of their similarity to bat bugs. As for this bug, a pest control specialist says they can't see it clear enough to identify it. But whatever it is, it's all the talk here and letting some kids out of school for the day. Now, contrary to what we're hearing from some other students, which is also uh, seemingly a rumor with students, is that there's no school tomorrow. The district says there is, in fact, school as planned. Live in Commerce City, Mark Boyle, Denver 7.